Okay, this is the uh, centrifuge, and uh, I had uh, just added this new uh, fixed stem, and it seems to be working very, very well. Uh, and it's already uh, got a good collection of oil. You can't see with the uh, plexiglass, but it's got a good collection of oil all up inside of the uh, uh, aluminum uh, uh, drum. So it's working real good. Uh, this is the sump for the slot bucket, which the uh, drain sump here. There it is. It's right there. Just all you do is shut it off. Here, I'll fire it up. Just give it a quick. For example, how quick she comes up to speed. And the centrifuge is running. And now I'm going to open up the uh, feed valve. Search the feed. Feeding away, coming up to pressure. Give it just a little bit more volume. You have to adjust the volume, but you can overfeed it. This is the uh, centrifuge bowl. You can see the uh, real uh, gooey stuff that's caked up into the side. Uh, as I'll mention later, that's the remnants of 55 gallons worth of processing of the waste vegetable oil ran through a 5 micron bag filter, Hayward bag filter. And uh, you see there's quite a bit of uh, real fine particulate that normally would be uh, getting into your cardboard filters and clogging them up. Uh, this filter works really well. Simple centrifuge is the manufacturer. I'll pan down here is the the motor and the drain sump. Uh, this went to a machine shop and was fabricated uh, and uh, they did a really nice job. And this is the feed side here. I've got that disconnected right now but normally it goes down <clears throat> through around the other side of my truck into the uh, fuel tank. I'll pan around over here and show you the fuel tank. So I deposited uh, straight into the fuel neck on the other side uh, so it works right here in the back of my truck. I've removed the wing nuts off the top of the lid and this is how you clean it. You remove the plastic lid and uh, run this through the dishwasher. It cleans it up real good. And then uh, I start by using the piece of cardboard that I've folded up and I just go around the inside and uh, clean it. I've already got that process started down here. This is an example of how much sludge the centrifuge takes out. This is 55 gallons worth of gross oil product that was processed with this centrifuge. And you see the kind of really fine material. This material had gone through a 5 micron uh, nominal sized bag filter, but yet still you can see how, how much of it there is.